2017th, right? What? Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I am here with my most anticipated reads for May 2017. I have a total of six books this time. As usual, I tried to pick the less popular-ish books so that you guys get a different variety than most of the other booktubers. So hopefully I find something that you guys would enjoy as well. So without further ado, let us get started. The first book that I'm anticipating since I finished the first two books in the trilogy is Battle Mage by Taran Mathru. This is the third book in the Summoner trilogy and it is supposed to come out on May 2nd, 2017. I'm not going to say the synopsis for the third book because that's going to give the first two books away, but basically the trilogy follows a demon summoner named Fletcher. And he has the cutest little demon in the entire world and I need to see more of him and therefore this is on my list. I read the first two books last year and I absolutely loved them and I highly recommend this series if you're into like fantasy. It's really good and I have a review of it if you guys want to check it out. The second book that I'm anticipating for this month is called The Love Interest by Kale Dietrich. Probably saying that last name completely wrong but whatever. This book is supposed to come out on May 16th, 2017 and it follows Dylan and Caden who are part of a teenage spy organization. The agents of this organization are called Love Interests. Caden is a nice which means he's basically like the boy next door and Dylan is a bad which means he's basically the dark mysterious boy. They both have to pursue the same girl in order to try to make her fall in love with him and whoever does not succeed ends up being killed. I just think that this whole concept sounds so cool and from the synopsis it says that, that they find a love that they didn't expect. So I'm kind of hoping that they like fall for each other. I don't know if that's a thing but like fingers crossed that that's a thing. I don't know. Hopefully we'll see how that goes when I read the book. The third book that I'm anticipating for the month of May is called One of Us is Lying by Karen M. McManus and this is supposed to come out May 30th, 2017. It follows five students who all go into detention one afternoon and only four come out. A boy named Simon ends up being murdered and all four of the remaining students are suspects and they all have a motive for why they could have killed Simon. I love the concept of this book. I just think that mysteries are so much fun to read and I am way too excited to get my hands on this and also this cover makes me so happy. I love it so much so I'm very excited about this one. The fourth book I'm anticipating is called Sad Girls and it is by Lang Leave and it's supposed to come out May 30th 2017. The book follows main character Audrey who told a lie that ended up causing her classmate Anna to die. She's now constantly facing panic attacks that are making her life spiral out of control and that's when she meets a boy named Rad and things start to change. I don't know how I feel about this whole like love conquers mental illness thing. I haven't read any books where a character has panic disorder or anything like that or panic attacks so I'm really interested in that aspect of the book and I'm kind of really really hoping that it's not going to turn into the love conquers all mental illness trope but we'll see how it goes. The fifth book I'm excited for is called It's Always the Husband by Michelle Campbell and it's supposed to come out May 16th, 2017. This book follows Kate, Aubrey, and Jenny who have been friends for 20 years and they love to hate each other. The story is told from present time and also the past 20 years of their friendship and it's basically showing why one of them is standing on the edge of a bridge and somebody, we don't know who, is encouraging them to jump. And it's basically us trying to figure out who it is telling them to jump. And you know, quite often it's always the husband, so we're gonna see who it actually is. I'm hoping it's one of the girls and I'm like super excited about it, not gonna lie. It sounds really good and I'm hoping it's like a psychological thriller kind of thing and I can't guess the ending but we'll see how that goes. 
And then the sixth and final book is actually a graphic novel, which I'm actually getting a copy of from the publisher, so thank you so much to Macmillan for sending me a copy of this book. I'm super excited to read it. But it is Spill Zone by Scott Westerfield, and it is supposed to come out May 2nd, 2017. This graphic novel follows Addison and her little sister Lexa, who lost their parents in a chemical spill. They live outside the spill zone, which is where the chemical spill happened, and nobody is allowed to enter the spill zone because it's dangerous. But Addison needs to provide for her little sister, so she makes a living by going into the spill zone and taking pictures of the stranger things that she sees there. That's really all the synopsis says about it, but I've never actually read a graphic novel, so I'm very excited to actually read one. And from the Goodreads reviews, they all have been very good, so I'm very excited about this. Alright guys, so those were the six books that I'm most anticipating. Let me know down below which books you're anticipating or if you're excited about any of these books. And I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!